ladies and gentlemen, and as always, thank you for watching. Uh, today, it sounds like we have one heck of a mess. We've been called by local police department, uh, said that they have a truck with a trailer that was hauling cars that has left the roadway, gone down about a 60 foot embankment, and all they said was that it was a big mess. Uh, as always, we ask for prayers, good thoughts, well wishes for all involved. I'm gonna go assess the situation with the rotator, which is what they requested first, and then we'll call in reinforcements as needed. Uh, again, we ask for prayers, good thoughts, well wishes for all involved. Here we go. Yep, yep, a tagline helps control the swing. Go, 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 people, go, go! Here, Gavin, while he's setting up, let's throw some of this stuff in the bed. Oh, dang! Y'all got another one. Oh, dang! Y'all got another one. Thought y'all was gonna get hit a couple of times and I ran over. Yeah. I told them keep going, just watch your back, and I'd come over here and help watch you guys till you got reinforcements here. Yeah, we It's going to be fine. Anybody remember the old game Frogger? <laughs> Wonderful. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right, Gavin, scoot back, bud. All right, Gavin. Uh, spreading my legs out here since I'm gonna have to reach out and lift. Probably gonna have to keep the fronts a little bit shorter. Yep, I'm good. I ought to be good on that little car now, that big one work truck I'm gonna have to do something different on. I'm gonna have to angle my truck different so that I can get my uh, out, outrigger spread completely out because that's gonna be a hefty lift. Hey Gavin, before you come down any further, get that uh, rope and let's tie off to this guardrail so that we've got a handhold. Uh, we've got a we've got a safety line coming down. No, 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 no. The our uh, the rope we used earlier on the uh, here. Why don't I use my comms instead of yelling? <laughs> so, uh, no, the uh, tie off rope, the uh, one on the orange spool, the tagline. Yes, sir. Yep. That's the tagline. Oh my goodness, this is slick. Uh, I think it's in box, the front box on this side. Box seven, orange spool. Yeah, because if somebody comes tumbling down here, there's a lot of rock down here. Yep. 
Yeah, wrap it around, uh, wrap it around the uh, guardrail, and then just let and loop it into itself, and then that way you we can walk ourselves down here. Always turn around and back down, bud. Grab a hold of it and you always turn around and you back down. Or you come down sideways. That way you've got more pressure on your feet. There you go, there you go. Just try to lean back. Yep, there you go. Yep, there you go. You're doing fine, bud, you're doing fine. set up the spreader bar because for that second one we're going to have to have a spreader bar and since we're going to have to set it up we might as well set it up and do it now all right now that you got our line down there come back up and help me get the spreader bar set up please sir there and then we'll have to have these uh, two of these white caps they're serial numbered to match okay. 740 and 740 pull both of those out while I'm grabbing the tube up at the top Take it out and set it along beside the uh, outrigger. Yeah, guardrail, whatever. Either way, either way will work. All right, now we need our pins and we need a whole bunch of these. Yep. Which, oh my goodness. up here for now we'll just we'll get this set up and we'll go from there all right grab one of those end caps no nope. right there bud yeah pick it up there you go it's so much easier with two people all right 
Now I'll grab the other one and let it go on the other end. Before we put any of these shackles on there, let's decide what we're gonna do, all right? Where are my orange slings? They are right here. I don't need them for this, but they work because they're the right length. All right, so what we'll do, we take one shackle, and attach that strap to that shackle. And then we'll have one big one that hooks the two straps together. I'll get it. Part of the sling always goes to the strap or the ah, round part of the shackle goes to the strap. All right. I don't think I was ever going to get through that northbound lane. Yeah, you missed the other side. Yeah, they had a they had a nasty mess over there. Bender, bender. Ah, uh, from what it looked like, somebody just stopped in the middle of the road. The other one was coming up, and when they stopped, I mean, they had no choice. Boom! Yeah. Just bam! I made it to the shop and got that trailer. I got out, looked at it, I tried to bend it back, but there was no bending in it, so I just took it easy. All right. I got it dropped. Okay. I got headsets, okay. batteries loaded up, they're already ready. Head right inside the door. Especially on the car, it won't take much. We'll get, uh... all right, let's get four of those that are the same length. They should all be the same length. Make sure they're the same length. On those, the uh, diameter is not going to matter. On that big heavy truck, it will. We need one more of those. They're in here. Happy Friday, everybody. Yeah. do this right we can if we do this right we can set it all up I need one end of two of those. The same end, I need, I need them long ways. Here, trust me, like this. 
we'll rig everything up and then we'll set the take the rigging down with, with the boom that way we ain't got to carry it down now you see what i'm doing here let that go set that down right there now do the same thing on the other end Yeah, the rollback will be next. Have, go ahead and uh, stop him back behind. Well, he can come in front of the police car, that's fine. But we'll want the rollback there as long as your air board is on. Is your air board on? If it's not, yes. Okay, you gotta, here, here Dalton. What's wrong here? Oh, uh, yeah. It's gotta be hooked into there. <laughs> The aero board, oh, the yeah, traffic it's advisor. It's on. Okay, all right. He said the traffic advisor is on the aero board. <laughs> You're making this too hard on yourself, bud. Here, no. Okay. okay. And just put it through there. Screw it in. Here, long arms. Grab those two for me, please. Maybe. We're going to take them down. Uh, I'm going to get this down there first. four chains right here with orange hooks and the black coverings over them. We'll attach one of those into each of the wheels and loop them into those rim slings if they'll fit. You know what I mean? You understand what I'm talking about? Nope. Each one of those rim slings is going to go on this is going to go on one side of the car yep. that's going to go on one side of the car yep. one of these is going to go to the front tire and one's going to go to the rear tire okay this will go through the rim on the tire yep. and through the hole on that sling okay okay Probably not going to have enough reach to get all the way out to it. No, we'll just, uh, yeah. I mean, yes, we'll have to drag it a little bit, but we'll go ahead and get it hooked in. I hope. Yeah, there's a there's a safety line right here. Headsets are in here. 
quick drop out, huh? I'm gonna have to all right guys we're gonna need some hands down here helping get this set up All right, just let it let it go down for a little bit. Cause this is going to take more of us. Uh, I could probably just have slung it through the roof, just as easy. But all right, I need the little chains. I need two on my side. That's the idea, yep. Man, that's really gonna throw things off. I can go around this top. Uh, hold on. Right now, this goes to here. Yep. Like that. Okay. Yep. And you want to make sure that we don't get tight on the hook. Yep. All right, now, you and I are going to have to get some help. We're going to have to lift this bar up over the top of the car. Come on, guys. We're going to need help up here. You get over here so I can... Yep. All right. All right, Ethan, get up there and grab the spreader bar. So just enough... You can probably, we can probably set it up. Hey, if we get it right here on front of the windshield, it'll be okay, probably. Because all I have to do is be able to reach the back tire. We just don't have enough boom to get it all the way out over the top of it. Just nice and gently. I've got my end. Come on, big man. Okay, now you're you guys are gonna have to roll it because that's the top where the orange sling right, is is the roll, top. Lift and roll. All right. All right. Whoa. You All want right. To hold Ethan. it here until we get tension or what? Uh, no. Here, I got something you. here. Well, somehow it got turned around. This one's gonna have to here, just switch out. It'll sit right there now. Yeah, I know. That needs to go on this one. Okay. Let me fix it now. Yep. We need to. You undo that one. I'll go back here to this one. Oh, you're using my chain slings. Yes, I'm using the chain slings. You are correct. <sighs> That's you. Yep, I hear it. All right. All right, everybody clear out. We're gonna... Hello, Gavin. That's what that line is. You got that right on camera, like right in front of him. All right. Everybody, come on up. Hang on, dude. All right, yeah, if you want to stay down here and watch, 
Watch it off from the side though until I get it in the in the air. But it's gonna pull up towards us first before it lifts. All right, getting ready to put tension on it. It's gonna bring the rear first, okay? That's all right. It's good. Gavin, or Dalton. Run over and check it. Move. Yeah, go on the other side and look real quick. Just make sure. And then I can swing it around and get it to level out. We'll be all right. Still hooked in, isn't it? Good. All right, I'm going to swing it up towards the rear, which will be to your right. All right, just let me have it from here, Dalton. It's going to drag it a little bit. Don't worry about it. It's going to drag it until it gets directly under the boom. Yeah, you lost, a, lost one. If it's hooked in good, we'll need it. Yeah, that's probably the quickest dismount I've done with that truck. Because I just left it right outside the uh, gate for now. So okay. I wasn't going to screw with trying to back it in the fence. Don't worry about it. As long as we can get it up on the road, we're good. All I need to do is lift. No, you, you can come up. Yeah, I can go down there. No, you're not going to need to. As long as, as long as everything's good. Because once it gets a, another couple feet up this way, I'll start picking. See that thank you all right honestly if you can bring the roll back you can set it back yeah but uh with with mike's rollback i know we can the little pete might be too long i don't know we can try it we'll have to run the under each up go ahead and run the under each up bud go ahead you want me to go ahead and bring the roll back up yeah is there a way later on i can get that plate off that trailer that crash happened before i took a picture of it for the crash report yes sir by all means perfect hey, i'm gonna go over here and go to the box sorry no you're good you're good i just think that needs to be a picture He's going to have to come up as close as he can to me. Hey, Gavin, stay back here. Stay back here. All you'll have to move is one or two cones so that he can sneak in in front of that little peak. Yep, that one. That one right there, and maybe the one back towards me. There you go. Never mind. Police officer's got it. Yeah, get some good pictures, Ethan, please. 
Okay, Dalton, you're gonna have to bring it in tight. Ethan, watch your back. There, there, no, hug, hug the white, come right in behind me. Come, come right in square behind me. Ooh, what's that all over the deck? Oh, okay. All right, straighten out. You're gonna, you're gonna have to straddle this right here. We, we may have, we may have to pull one of these pins. Listen to me. Listen to me. Straight ahead. To the right. To the right. Keep coming at the way you are. Keep coming. Keep coming. Keep coming to the right. 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 About two to three inches more. A little bit. A little bit. Whoa. Lock her down. Not a not a scratch. Uh, yeah, here, look. The the forks are straddling the underreach and the lights are just that much. Alright, here we go. Alright, coming around guys, watch yourselves. I think that same technique's going to work on the uh, no, uh, truck. We're going to have to have chains or something, or longer. Yeah, I see that. Hold on. Just ladder, ladder swing. All right, start getting your wheel straps out. They're on the other side. All right, Ethan, you want to help yeah, me line it up? I got that detector. All right. Hold on. Hold on. Ethan's helping me with these. Good side to side. Needs to come over this way. All right, coming down. Nope, that's not a wheel strap, Gavin. Ethan. Go show them what the wheel straps are, please. I know, I know. I'm not, I'm not busting at anybody. I'm just trying to get the job done, all right? That's it. It's a learning experience. I get it. There's only two on each side, guys. There should be two on each side.
I'm just getting the boom and the stuff out of the way. Go ahead and help them get that one secured and get that truck out of here. Uh, get it back up to or back to the shop, and then we'll uh, start rigging this one. Uh, <sighs> you think that's all kind of? You think that's all kind of messed up? You should see this down here. Gavin, we need that line down there still. No, 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 we still need that. We still want that on. Talk about a talk about an almost a Pratt fall. There's quite literally a banana peel right there, and I slipped on it. Had I not had this in my hand, all right, help me pull this down. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't pull too much. Or it's hard. All right. Should have pulled out. Well, we're going to, I'm going to take this one and we're going to use it on that front wheel. Okay. Roll it. We'll just roll it and then we'll grab both ends and drag it up close as we can get so we can, then we can sling it and lift it. Well, I didn't know if you wanted to drag sideways or drag forward down, like nose out. I don't know. I just feel like it'd be the least, least amount of resistance dragging forward. If it'll roll. If it'll roll. Uh, I just want to be able to grab a hold of it and not be pulling against it like we were on the car because this yeah. one's so much heavier. Yeah. And it's lopsided with that yeah, with that heavy boom. On the downside. It's heavy on the downside. So all right, I'll get the boom stretched around. Will this go through those the front steel wheels? Okay. Take that one down. Gavin, help him get that blue line down there. For right now, I'm just gonna go to that front steer tire, the high.
No, they are not. That's another problem I wanted to try to avoid was those daggum rocks. Use that for the roll. All right, slack coming in. It's got air in it. I rolled it a while ago. Well, it's either that or we load it on the uh, rollback. I don't know. I think that truck's too heavy for the rollback, though. That's why that rope's there. I'm not going to roll that until you're clear, Ethan. Yeah, that's why I left it there. I, I started rolling it up and decided, nope, it's going to stay. All right. I saw that. Yep, leg workout, leg day. Well, this is actually cardio and full body day. Yeah, this is, this is full body workout day. I don't know. I'd say it probably is. Alright, Gavin, let's rehook. Yeah, now let me just see if I can drag it up a little bit. Where it's at. Guess what? It's in the way. That tire. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Here, we can move the we can move the tag line. Or here, Gavin, use the wire rope. Yeah. Yep. Like, yep. Hunter, was it? Yes. That was? Yes. What did we go up here? He just had a mustache. Oh, come on, man. Ah! Uh, my progress. That really needed to come up the hill, Gavin. No, I don't want you on the downside while I'm pulling this truck up. We'll worry about it later, okay? You little, you little cotton-pitting mini muggins. <laughs> All right, come on. Everybody learn to get along. Too, I'm trying to concentrate here. Yep. 
for now until I can get where we can uh, get that spreader bar over the top of it. You darn right, I'm gonna drag it as long as it's gonna drag up, I'm gonna drag it up. That's why I'm, uh, yeah, steel wheel, that's why I'm dragging it the way I'm dragging it. I don't know if we even really need to mess with the spreader bar, do we? Well, yeah. either that or we're gonna have to walk it over the guardrail, which I really don't wanna do. Uh, there should be water behind the seat of the uh, rotator. Okay, Ethan, help me drag this out the way. I want it off to the side, so I want this up, I want this truck up closer. There we go, thank you boys. Gavin, reach down and grab those straps all the way up against the guardrail. Grab those straps, uh, the rim slings. There you go, pull them up. And then get out the way. Well, nobody got hurt in this one. It was in the secondary crash that somebody got hurt. Okay. Those good wheel chalks, Gavin. Let's have them. Hopefully that thing will sit there. This time I want them both on the uh, back side one up, one up here on the front and one on the behind the drive tires okay because it's going to want to roll downhill and we want to hold it um, hey Ethan I think what I want to do get me one of the auxiliaries and we'll let's get a secondary hold on this thing while we rig the uh, nope does not matter which one as long as we've got a secondary on it to hold it while we get the uh, spreader bar in place. We'll go uh, just uh, a long chain to the front through the springs or something. You, please. Chain. I just wanna I just wanna hold it so it doesn't fall down down the hillside on us. As long as you can I just want it, there, there's plenty of longer chains up there. Even our uh, tie down chain that we use for the heavy trucks be good enough. Yes. That's why I had it out. That's the same as I've got in this one over here. Uh, well, here, hold on, buddy. Uh, let's use our tie downs because I'm gonna use the 3 8 to lift with, I hope. All right. Uh, yeah. Is it? That's, that's what I said, wasn't it? Go around the axle. Ah, it don't matter. Long as it... That's why we're putting a second on it right here. All right. Should be uh, behind the seat, bud. Uh, yeah, if there's one available, yes, I would love one, please. It should just be in that storage well behind the seat.
Alright, Ethan. Ethan. Red hook behind you is anchored off here to the outrigger leg. That way we've got a low tie-off point on it. And we don't have to trust the uh There we go. Alright. It's all right, I ain't worried about it. I knew there was a case of water in there. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Gavin, when are you gonna learn to trust me? When are you gonna learn to trust me? Gavin, so that you understand what's going on. You put the wheel chocks on, right? This thing's heavy and it's at a steep angle. We've redirected off that auxiliary line down here low to the truck so that the winch line is holding the truck, this truck, from rolling back down. And we're using it off the secondary part of the boom. Huh? Anyway, all right, so what we need, Ethan, is we need more of these uh, 3 8 chains. We're going to have to get this thing leveled out. We're going to use the rim slings, but the chains will be to adjust the distance. You understand what I mean? We're still using rim slings, but we need the heavier chains. We've got two of them right here. We've got this one and we've got that one. There's two more in my truck right there. Uh, the 3.8s, not the 5.16s. There's a, there's a 5.16s. There should be two 20 footers in there. I, yeah, because what we've got right now is the two 10 footers. We could even use just the chains instead of the chains and the rim slings. But I figured this would give us a little bit more since they're already on there. one of my tie downs. We need one on each side, but now the difficult part of this is going to be figuring out how to level it out. I just have to uh, make some on-the-fly adjustments. 
Ja. Get your legs clear in case they do not have any part of your body to where if this thing breaks loose. Not yet because uh, I uh, have to roll it back a little bit. This chain came under or was too tight, so I couldn't get in it. Yeah, we're good. Yes. Uh, just up toward the top, bud. Up toward the top of the wheel. Yeah. Front. Yep, like that. Grab right through that hole. There you go. That's a what I want right there. Do you want the loop on this? Well, I don't know. That's what we're going to have to try to figure out. It may, I don't know. It may take a little bit of adjustment on our part to find the right length. Let's try that. Okay. So go help Gavin with that other side and see if that's about, about the right. Good one, Gavin. Good one. <laughs> As my dad used to say it, today runs all the way up till midnight. The day runs all the way up until midnight. And then at 12.01 it becomes tomorrow becomes the day. Alright. You guys clear? Why? That one's mine. On your left left hand, that one's mine. How do we look? I don't like the way that straps on that. that mirror but Let's see what happens here I thought he was Woo! she's a little hefty it's a hefty girl huh 
Uh, I don't have it all the way up yet. That's actually, actually that's not bad. It's not as level as I'd like it, but it's good with the incline. All right, so let's get this red line undone. If we can just get it up here on the road, we're good. So let's go undo this red one. I've got it in the air. Kevin, you got that one? Just undo the red. Take the chain loose. Just take the chain. Yeah, just pull it all out. Okay, it kind of gets stuck in between there. You're going to have to lift up. All right, all right. Just leave it. Leave it. Come on out of there. Want to do this? Bring it up out of there. Now remember, you've got an off-center load. Yeah. Oh, we're just on white line. Yeah, white line only. So, and you're bottomed out on your white line. So your boom. It's all in the boom. Now. It's all in the boom at this point. Unless, and if you don't like it, we'll set it down and redo it. Main thing for now is getting it over the guardrail and back here on the pavement. Uh, last time I looked, it was a little after three, but I don't know what it is right now. It's 317. Whoa, whoa. Do what? back, buddy. Yep. You're good. We've got a, hey, if we take that tree, we've got a, something for our pond. That looks like a uh, cypress or a Christmas tree. Yep. A little, a little, that'd be great for the pond. That's just a perk, a little added bonus there. It's not, well, the truck's not level, but we're getting it up. Now, are the steer tires blown? Hold on, Ethan. Hold on, Ethan. Yep. Gavin, come around. Come back here, bud. Don't ever, don't ever get in a pinch point there. All right, you got, you're fully traveled to the front, so, but, but you're on the rear corner. So I would swing it back around behind you a little bit more. Rotate it around. I get it as behind you as you can before you travel. That way you're not on that weakest point. All right, now roll her back. Now you can travel back. Now we're gonna. We need to decide now. Are we gonna tow? Or are we gonna put it on the uh, semi? I can get the semi here, that's why I'm saying we need to know now so I can get it on the on the way. Then we're gonna have to pull the drive shaft. Unless these front tires are good, and then we spin it around and tow it from the back. What? Passenger side is flat? Okay. Alright, set her down, bud. You ought to be able to winch down. Yep, hold on. Ethan, let him get that chain out from under it. Yep. All right, now, before you set the front end all the way down, we'll put some blocks under it.
Do what? I can't understand what you're saying. Grab what? Wheel chalk. Oh, yes, please. I think it'd be too heavy for it. We're just gonna tow it with the uh, 2010. No, nope. uh, we're okay, I think. All right, all right, thanks, bye. What? Take the auxiliary line down and just make sure. Well, the only thing we gotta do is pull the drive shaft. I was gonna say we can do that or swap the tire either way. Easy. If that tire that works tire on this. And it's a steer tire. Well then we'd have to spin it around backwards. And can we secure the wheel? Yeah, the tire needs to come up. Yeah, we, we can we can grab it with a winch line even if we need to, but hold on, hold on. I'm gonna take that block off of it. You don't need that block on there too. on this side of the guardrail. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. That's hey, that's a big part of the job. That's right. Oh. Well, do we uh, spend our time and pull the shaft or we just get the semi up here and load it? I should have the sockets, I hope. Get uh, get some wood blocks and we'll jack that front end up. Set the front end up on blocks. Yep. Oh. My, my goodness, this Jenga. kind of straps ah. they're in yeah I've got driveline sockets in my box right there oh. who decided that it was full body workout day oh. Shouldn't need them. Everything you need should be in that black pack. My black impact case. Oh, why didn't you grab mine? I thought that's where you're going. Because I got all the right stuff to do it with.
Well, this tire's flat, that one's not. So let's see what happens when we set her down. I might have done this before, bud. <laughs> I was just getting ready to say that. Yep. I got it. Yep, get that shaft out from under there and I'll start putting this stuff up. Yeah, we're gonna use that little truck right there to drag it with. Tow it out of here. Yo, what do you need, bud? What do you need? Hold on, Ethan, one at a time. Gotcha. You found my torque spits? Oh, no. Nope. All right, Ethan. Fatigue is sitting in here. All right, red line coming in. Well, you got a fishing license? You got a fishing license for that? I don't know, you tell me. <laughs> Do I? Are we legal to be doing this? <laughs> hey, Gavin, might be better if you wrap a chain and then hook the chain. Where? Okay. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. All right, Gavin. Take this chain and make a loop just like we did with the others and then take that uh, red hook and put it in that loop. Coming down at you, you stay there. What kind of driver? No, no, no. If we, if we don't, I'm gonna get the semi headed this way, quick. Well, come up and look in my truck and see if we got what we need. Because I usually keep everything I need in here. All right, everybody clear on the plan though? All right, I'll move forward, give you plenty of room to come in and hook up. Yep. You've already made so many trips down. I'm afraid if I pull, it's just gonna keep unraveling. We need our tagline. Yep. Yeah, put everything up except the uh, except the bar itself. Whew. Yes, put all put all of my chains away, and I'll move out of the way, and I will put the spreader bar up while you guys hook up to this truck and get it ready to tow away. We've already got the shaft ready. It's jacked up. Should be able to just grab the axles and go. Chain, chain it down, put the light bar, all that, you know. You know how that works. I'm going forward. Everybody clear? Going into motion forward. 
No, leave the cones out. Leave the cones out. We need a safe work zone. Please leave them out. I'm out. I'm clear. You should have plenty of room to get in front of me. Or behind me, I mean. Gavin, like we did a while ago, push, just push them over nice and gently. Yep. I'm, yep, I'm coming on it. Yep, there you go. Just stay over. Yep. Come on through, come on through. Nope, don't stop them. Just keep coming beside them. Come beside them. Sorry, right, you got it. There you go. No, cones stay out until we are ready to roll out. That provides a safe work zone. Wasn't so doggone wide, I'd almost leave the uh, spreader bar hooked up and undo it at the shop. Y'all about I'm about packed up up here guys. I'm about packed up up here guys. I'll come help you in a minute. Give me just a second. Here, watch, uh, just slide me that other chain, or that block. Slide me that block. That, that's one single. No, we need the two single ones. Okay, Gavin, you understand the plan, right? Just come on the shoulder right up behind this officer. Keep your airboard on so they keep them off of us. Yes, I got you. Do what? Dude, this is this is nice and cool. Uh, wait until the heat of summer and we have to do this crap. Yeah. <sighs> okay. No, nope, we'll just have we'll just have Gavin. All right. Took the cones down and we already got an idiot trying to hit us. That's why we leave the cones out, Gavin.
All right, Ethan, get yourself over onto the shoulder. I'm gonna throw the cones in. We may have to straighten them out later, but we'll worry about that when we get off this road. Oh, come on, you baby, come on. Gavin, you ready? I'm just getting myself over. We'll wait on Gavin to come on up. I cannot see Gavin, Ethan, so you may have to relay. I think we've lost comps. Gavin, you ready? Ethan, you ready? Yep. All right, let's. I'm gonna get up to speed. Let's roll out. No. We, we may have to come back and get it. Now, the cop will probably swing by you. Ethan, relay that. You, you sneak in behind Ethan. gentlemen that is it long difficult task but we managed to succeed uh, again we ask for prayers good thoughts well wishes for the people involved in the accident on the other side nobody was injured in the accident that was on our side thank thankfully here was one of the officers that was helping us Special thanks to the Cape Girardeau Police Department. Oh, they had us covering our six all day. Well, all afternoon. All right, I'm gonna sign off here. I might turn on the air conditioner. Whew. As always, thank you for watching and God bless. <laughs>